Hello, my name is RD and we are going to solve problem 3.20 from Sadiku book. So the question is for the circuit in figure 3.69, find V1, V2, and V3 using nodal analysis. Okay, let's see what we get from the circuit here. We will have our bottommost node here as our ground, so the voltage here will be zero. Okay, now V1 and V2 is connected by this voltage source, and V1 and V3 also connected by a voltage source. So we need to use super node here. So I will have all the nodes here covered, so V1, V2, and V3 are a really big super node. So I will have I will highlight this here in gray. So all of this gray highlighted part is assumed to be a very big node. So I will have it like this. Okay, let's name this gray part here as our super node. Let's do that. So this is our super node. Now, we can assume the direction of the current. Maybe this is going out, and then this is going out, and then this is also going out. So all the current that, uh, all the currents from the super node is going out. So we can get the KCL at super node. So I'll have KCL at the super node. KCL said that the sum of the current that goes in will equal to the sum of the current that goes out. Okay, all the currents is going out. There is no current that goes in, so I'll have zero on the left-hand side. And then we will have this current here, which is P1 minus zero divided by four. Good. And then I will have P2 minus zero divided by one. P2 minus 0 divided by 1. And then I will have P3 minus 0 divided by 4. P3 minus 0 divided by 4. Good. Now let's multiply both sides by 4 to get rid of all the denominator. 4 and 4 will cancel each other. So I will have P1. And then... V2 minus 0 divided by 1 is just V2, but V2 multiplied by 4 is 4 V2. Okay, good. And for this term, 4 and 4 will cancel each other. And so we leave it with V3 minus 0, that will be V3. So we have plus V3. And then 0 multiplied by 4, that will be 0. So I put that here. So that will equal to 0. Good. I think we have the first equation here. So this is equation number one. Good. Now we take a look at inside the super node. The difference between V1 and V3 has to be 12 volt, right? So we see it from 12 volt voltage source. So we will have V1 minus V3. V1 minus V3 is equal to 12. I think nothing more that we that we can do from this part. So this is equation number two. Okay, now let's see the dependent voltage source. So I will have dependent voltage source. Okay, what can we get from here? P1 minus V2 is equal to 2I. Okay, P1 minus V2 is equal to 2I. Okay, but I is V3 minus 0 divided by 4. Let's substitute that. So I'll have P1 minus V2 is equal to 2 multiplied by V3 minus 0. And then divided by 4. Okay, 2 and 4 will cancel into 2 and we can multiply both sides here by 2. So I will have 2v1 minus 2v2 
and then this will cancel each other so that is 2v2 this will cancel each other into v3 okay so i will have 2v1 minus 2v2 minus v3 that will equal to zero okay now we have three equation and three variables i think it is easier to make it in the matrix form so i will have one four and then one here and this one i will have one zero minus one then for this one i will have two minus two and then minus one good and now i will have p1 p2 and p3 and the result factor is 0 12 and then 0 good now let's get our calculator set up and then equation is number 5 three variables is number 2 and i will have 1 4 1 and then 0 good and then 1 0 minus 1 and then 12 and then 2 minus 2 minus 1 and then 0 hopefully the number is good okay so i will have p1 is equal to minus 3 so i will have p1 is minus 3 and the unit will be 4 right and then what else i will have p2 here which is 4.5 p2 is equal to 4.5 Again, here the unit will be 4, and then V3 here is minus 15. So I'll have V3 is equal to minus 15, and the unit here is also 4. So this is the final answer for this problem. Maybe let's highlight this P1 is minus 3 volt, P2 is 4.5 volt, and then V3 is minus. 15 volt. So V1, V2, and V3 are the variables that is asked by the question. And we got it all. Okay, that's all for this problem. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.